It's Laura Caldwell here from pastybat.com and I'm on the line with the face of the 2012 London Olympics campaign, critically acclaimed grime artist Wretch 3 2 He's had three top five singles, amassed over a million record sales and now he's on his way to Belfast to play as part of the Filthy series. So, Wretch, Mr. 3 2, what should we call you? Um, you can call me anything you like. Um, but hopefully good things though, no, or, or just Wretch. Wretch is cool. Wretch is good, okay. So where does that name come from? Um, do you know, just something, just a little nickname people used to call me as a kid. And um, Does it make... <clears throat> it kind of stuck, the name Wretch. And then 3-2 um, it... were my lucky numbers, so I just added it on. So Wretch, does it mean anything or...? It was because I was quite mischievous. That's what you call like a naughty little kid, a little wretch. <laughs> so, well, this isn't going to be your first time in Northern Ireland. You were here in 2013 to play Radio One's Big Weekend. Yeah. What do you think of the place? Love it, man. Um, I think the people are friendly. Um, they have a good time and a good vibe, and there's a lot of love in the room, like any room you're in. I, I, I enjoy that, man. Do you ever actually get a chance to explore, or is it just all work? No, nah, yeah, yeah, we get to um, we get to roll around and stuff. Um, we, we we just you know we we I, I I don't like to just come to a place and just not see nothing, you know. So we kind of always you know just wandered, wander around a bit. And how do Northern Irish crowds compare to other crowds that you've played to? I think they're very they're very warm and welcoming. And when I say that, I mean like other crowds they might not have heard a record before. You might be performing a new song, and it's like. Okay, I'm gonna perform this new song, and then they kind of just want to hear what they know. But I think with you guys, it's it's it's, uh, it's not like that. I feel like everyone's kind of like, okay, yeah, let's let's hear it, let's check it out, and try and enjoy the record, and try and learn the words and stuff. We're up for Edison over here. Yeah, that's it. Um, well, a lot's been happening for you since the last time you were here. You're on the verge of releasing a new album. You've released your latest single, Six Words, late last year. And it's actually a lot different to your previous tunes. It's a bit more melodic. We can hear your singing voice. Yeah. Can we expect more like this from the upcoming album? There's moments. And I think the, the, the good thing about this record is even even the melodic bits, even if it's not me singing, I've, I've actually written it myself as well. So you're still going to get that element, but it might just not be coming through me. Um, but there are definitely some other little moments like that, but not any whole record that's like six words. No. And you've been touring a lot since the release of your second album. Uh, has being away from home affected your music in any way? Do you find, your, find that your style is changing? Nah, I don't think it's due to being away from home. I just think me growing as a person, hence why I call the next record Growing Over Life. I feel like just the growth in me has kind of, you know, really really pushed me um, in, in terms of writing and stuff like that. So, yeah. Well, the Filthy Series Festival is coming up this May Bank Holiday weekend in Belfast Filthy Quarter. You're going to be playing on the 2nd of May. Can fans expect any new material from you then, or are you just sticking to the hits? No, nah, I definitely want to try some new stuff. Um, so, yeah, yeah, we sh- I'll, I'll see how it goes, man, because, you know, we're in the process of, of picking what records are happening next, so it'll be good to try some out. So there might be a couple of little special appearances? Yeah, well, everything's going to be special. The whole experience is going to be special, so yeah. And you'll be playing alongside the likes of KDB, Jungle, Reaps One. Are you looking forward to see any of them play? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna soak in the day, man. I think it's, it's, it's always good, like when when other artists show the other artists support as well. And obviously, I know KDB for many years now, so it'd be good to catch up with her. Well, so you'll be, you'll be able to actually relax and enjoy it then. Yeah, definitely. Well, that's everything. We're really looking forward to the Filthy series in Belfast on the 2nd and 3rd of May, and we can't wait to see what you've got in store for us. And thanks very much for talking to us. Thank you. Look forward to seeing you.